Okay, this is take four on uh, 1 John 1 9 thingy. Ah. Alright, you see I'm blinking my eyes and so that's why the camera's doing it too. I have to hold my head very still though. Okay, I want to clarify something so that we know exactly what's going on here, okay? If you don't use 1 John 1 9, you are walking in the darkness. That's 1 John 1 6. In other words, it's like being online and going offline while you're still working on the computer. Okay? You're online with God when you use 1 John 1 9 until you next sin. You next sin when you sin. But sins are many in your head. You won't necessarily recognize that's what you're doing. For example, if you believe a false doctrine, then you've just believed a lie at that moment. In other words, you believe in some doctrine, but you're not thinking of it at the moment you use 1 John 1 9. So now you, you're cleared of, of it. But then, you know, five minutes, five seconds later, that doctrine occurs to your mind again and you still believe it wrongly. Okay, so now you are, in fact, sinning. I can't get the camera to fit me. Let's see, how do I have to move my head? I, I have to keep my head very still. Is it working? Yes, it's working. If I blink my eyes, I can tell. Okay, so the problem is that you don't know when you're sinning the next time because you don't know what false doctrine you're still believing. Because to you, it's not false yet. You haven't, you're not aware of it. God teaches you, you know, basic math before he takes you to calculus. All right, and a lot of the doctrines in the Bible that are critical to your spiritual life are, are more sophisticated. So what do you do? You just keep using 1 John 1 9 like breathing, okay? Because you won't necessarily know if you're off. You won't necessarily know if you're not in the light. Okay? In other words, you're walking and walking and walking and you've just finished going into the darkness, but you can't tell because you think you're right. But you're not. So how do you tell? Well, you just keep using the verse, even if you're not sure. That's why I do all day long. In fact, I just used it just now, just in case. Okay, Dad, I sinned. I think I sinned. I confess my arrogance, Dad. I say stuff like that all the time, all day long, or I think it. While I'm typing an email, while I'm going to the bathroom. Well, if I use one John one I, I don't think I have. Dad, I must have sinned. Because it's you don't know. All right? Fellowship with God is a state. You're in fellowship or not. You're in fellowship when you are between sins. But since a sin is a thought or a belief in a false doctrine, and you're in the process of learning doctrine, so you're going to have a lot of false ideas in the beginning, then you don't know if you're out of fellowship suddenly. So you have to say, God, I must have sinned. I do that all day long, okay? And if I seem smart to you, that's the only reason why. This is why I call myself brain out, okay? I'm having trouble with the camera, so I'll stop now. If I did not make myself clear, if you're still not clear that you need 1 John 1 9 to actually be in fellowship with God so you can learn Bible, then let me know and I'll try to explain it again. Signing off.